Alrighty, everyone. Welcome back to the Old Republic. When we last left off, we had just gotten into the Great Hunt, and we were on our way to Dromund Kos. Now, we can get there one of two ways. We could take a shuttle. This is going to take a longer amount of time. Not for you and I, but for Devrim, it's going to take a longer time. Or, we could use the Black Talon, an Imperial transport ship. That's much faster, but a little more dangerous. I think we'll go that way. Let's see, what's all this? I'm not going to worry about crafting or anything like that. Anything I want, I can really just buy. Well, go down here. It's a rest area. And whenever you get this little icon over your companion, you can talk to your companions in rest areas, like your ship or a cantina. About the whole great hunt thing. Thanks. It'd mean a lot to Braden that you stuck with it. I'm in this for your sake more than his. Ooh. That's sweet in a total and complete lie kind of way. Great hunt was Braden's dream. Talked about it for years. The day he told me he'd found you. Should have seen him. Grinning and laughing so much, I thought his face would split in half. It's not every day you get a shot at the Great Hunt. Winning this thing? It would have meant more to him than revenge. So I'm gonna skip saying thank you again because you get the idea already. Let's just get moving. I've got the best hardware and the best prices. I'm sure you do, dude. Good hunting. Mem ama kupka kramanik umlu kiga mayamak nulilak apa jam kamgam amka nem nang ampa nem nang memua inok raka kalam kala nemia oramag yang megik. Just what I wanted to hear. That's good news. Nanekari Maraka Amkam, Jakuklibik, Memarak Nebab, Jaki Pamguana. Story. Tell the captain that I'll be back on the bridge as soon as I've done his errand. Yes, sir. Good to have you aboard. I'm Lieutenant Silas, second in command of the Black Talon. We're your ride to Drom and Cass. Well met and all that. Indeed. Welcome. It's not a comfortable ship, but as transports go, it does its job. On our present course, we should arrive at the capital within the day. Won't be any trouble. In the meantime, your droids in the conference room. We picked it up with the upgrades from Geonosis. When we docked here, it mentioned your name. Sorry. I don't know what droid you're talking about. Oh? 
The machine asked for you, so I assumed you were the owner. My mistake. In any case, it seems someone wants to get in touch. The conference room is down the hall. I'll be on the bridge. And you, soldier, when you're done playing honor guard, get back to your post. This isn't a luxury yacht. Yes, sir. Get to see how screwed up the Empire is here in a minute. Identity confirmed. Good day. I'm Advanced Protocol Unit NRO2. My functions are diplomacy, translation, manslaughter, and calumniation. I have an urgent message for you from my master. Please stand by for delivery. I'm paying attention. This is Unit NRO2 to Grand Moff Kilrin. You are now in contact with a Black Talon. Well, so I am. And it seems you've brought me just the person I've been looking for. My name is Rikus Kilrin. I'm commander of the Fifth Fleet, second to the Minister of War, and my personal favorite, the so-called Butcher of Coruscant. I don't understand. What's going on here? It's apparent I need another pair of hands. So I asked NR2 to check the ship's passenger manifest. My good fortune that I was in a position to contact you. I was already aboard the Black Talon. Six hours ago, the Republic engaged in an illegal border skirmish on the edges of Imperial territory. One enemy warship escaped. That warship, the Brentel Star, is carrying a passenger of vital strategic importance. Yours is the only vessel placed to intercept. Where do I come in? I'll explain in a moment. The warship's passenger is codenamed the General. We don't know his identity, but the Republic believes he possesses military secrets, our military secrets. I trust the reports. The General must be captured or killed. Captain Orzik, the man commanding your transport, doesn't share my enthusiasm. He's disobeyed my orders to attack. Feel free to show him what the Empire does to cowards. Then commandeer his ship, find the Brentel Star, and deal with the General. Sounds interesting, but you realize I don't work for free. I certainly understand, as will the Imperial Treasury. We need individuals like you if we're to survive the next Great War. I will lead the way to the bridge. Once Captain Orsic is deposed and our hijacking is complete, we may proceed to the Brentel Star. Excellent. Then I will proceed. Yeah, for those of you who didn't know, the Empire and Republic is a peace treaty right now, so they're not actually at war, but they have quote-unquote illegal border skirmishes all the time. Please move aside immediately. Halt! This is a restricted area. Captain Orzik's command. You'll have to leave immediately. I suggest you back off before someone gets hurt. I'm afraid I can't do that. This is the command deck entry hatch. No one's allowed in until we reach our destination. Time is limited. We must proceed to the bridge immediately. Our orders were to treat any approach as an attack. You need to take your droid and move it. Ooh, I'm shaking in my boots. <laughs> you had your chance. We warned you. Blasters out! Attack! Attack! We must proceed to the bridge immediately. Even if you're a Sith Lord or a Sith Apprentice, they attack. It's like, why? I'm fucking Sith. Doesn't make any sense to me. in my boots. If you are concerned about the loss of life, I assure you, the deaths of all injured crew members will be strategically insignificant. Isn't that nice? Hmm. 
so exhausted. On the captain. All Marines have been neutralized, scanning for additional threats. What's going on? Sir, stay calm, Ensign. Everyone stay calm. No threats found. The bridge is now secure. Call the med bay. I want help for the injured. Now. Acknowledged. Medical assistance will be properly rendered. Not a monster. I do appreciate that. I'm Captain Revenant Orzik. I'm pretty sure I know what this is about. For the record, I take complete responsibility for my actions. I understand, Captain. If nothing else, that should make it easier on the crew. I'm glad it's worth something. You're here because of the moth, aren't you? You must want the Bental Star's passenger pretty badly. Or maybe he just hates me. The Black Talon would be destroyed chasing a battleship. I fought in the war before, and I'll fight again, but I don't do suicide missions. My dogs are like... Jumping all over each other. I'm not looking to make a martyr of anyone. We can complete this mission and survive. I expect you believe that. I see it differently. Listen to me. You've managed to hijack one ship, and that's certainly impressive. But taking on the Bental Star is something else altogether. I might be able to get us close. But then you'd have to board it, fight an army of Republic soldiers, and somehow find the general. It's unacceptable. We don't have a choice. Those were Moff Kilrin's instructions. So if we're gonna survive, we need to work together. I see. You're as much a victim here as I am, aren't you? Damn Kilran and his fleet. All right. I'm not ready to be branded a traitor just yet. We'll get the general. I'm not sure how, but we'll get him. I got that covered. I'll do my best to remember that. Downloading new orders to all bridge consoles. Priority one, intercept the Brental Star. You heard the droid, everyone. Prepare to jump to light speed. Emerging from hyperspace now. One Thranta class warship on the scanners. Powering up. Enemy is firing. Turbo lasers, missiles, and what looks like transport pods. I'm not sure. Evasive maneuvers. Keep the pods at distance. They look harmless, but they'll latch onto the hull and cut at us with sabotage droids. Evasive maneuvers. Aye, sir. Sir, three shuttles on an intercept course. An assault party. We don't have sufficient defenses to keep them from landing. Let them land. I can handle any borders. This course of action is deemed advisable. Security will meet you at the entrance of the shuttle bay. Defend the ship at all costs, and we'll get you to the Bental Star. So that is a Thranta class uh, battleship, I believe. It's like the granddaddy to the hammerhead frigate from uh, Star Wars Rebels. And uh, the one that rammed into the uh, Star Destroyer and threw it off course and cut the other one in half. I wonder what happened to those guys in that movie if they died. Coming shuttle. y'all doing? <laughs> I guess they pissed each other off. Hit them with the tracer missile over their armor. Hit them with the rail shot. Finish them 
off with a few shots. It's one of the best combos you can do as a mercenary, bounty hunter. Need to kill 40 Republic Warriors. And we'll get the bonus objective. Should be easy. Sweeping blasters, why not? Ooh, new bell. Uh, definitely not as good as what I got. guys are still shooting at each other. Silly. I'm not scared of you. First boss fight up here to squad of uh, special forces. Alright, so I'm gonna hit them all with a fusion missile. You never should hit have the attacked the lead us. guy with a tracer. Rail shot. Unload. I'm get him with a dart. Damage everyone. Blast him with a rocket blast. Get him a few times. And then sweep him blast him. Get him another rail shot. Another explosive dart. Then heat. Alright, now. Hit you with another move. You never should have attacked us! Blast you. Hit the lead with a tracer missile. Fusion. Explosive dart. Imperial arrogance knows no bounds. Missile blast. Unload. I've beaten worse than you. Rail shot. I feel like an anime character saying my attacks before I do. Missile blast. Captain, if you can hear this, we need you on the bridge. What we get? Oh yeah, I got, got a cybernetic implant. So you can see, these are just clothes you wear, you got your weapons. Then you have special relics you find. Uh, tactical, what the hell is tactical? I can't remember that. Ah, shit, I'm drawing a blank. You got two implants, and then you got like an earpiece. I don't know how an earpiece helps, but it does. These are culto stations to heal. In case you're really in trouble. I'm 
So what we're doing right now is called a flashpoint, and for m most of the game in like your class story, it's told through just normal story-based quests. Then as you progress into the expansions, you have quests and stuff you do, and then they move the story forward through like the next chapter. They do that through like a flashpoint that takes like an hour to do or something like that. Damage reports from all decks. We're holding together, sir, but I don't know for how long. Make it last, Ensign. Don't let us down. Please stand alert. Grand Moff Gilran's representative has returned. I see you took care of the Republic Assault. Welcome back to the bridge. Thank you, Captain. We've survived the first wave of attacks from the Brental Star. Things will be calm until we enter fighter range. Another minute, maybe two. Transmission coming in. Long range. It's a message. But it's not from the Brental Star. Put it through, Ensign. This is Jedi Grand Master Satil Shan hailing an unidentified Imperial vessel. I'm en route to your location with 16 Republic vessels. I'm asking you to retreat before more lives are lost. Ooh, Satil Shan. She's the granddaughter or the great granddaughter of uh, Bastila Shan and Darth Revan. The protagonist from uh, Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. Spoilers for those of you who don't know. Well met and all that. I'm glad to hear a voice of reason. <laughs> Let us end this conflict together. The Brental Star is under my protection. Our convoy was ambushed and I sent the star ahead. We will reunite. I just crippled three Imperial Dreadnoughts. I don't wish to destroy you. The peace between Republic and Empire is fragile enough already. I don't play politics. Take it somewhere else. Even Mandalorians respect life. This isn't about politics. Incidents like this are happening across the galaxy, but only because we let them. Leave the Brentel Star to me. If you don't, then may the Force be with you. Because the men and women aboard that ship can hold you off until we arrive. And you will be defeated. We'll see about that. End transmission. Affirmative. Ending transmission. Entering fighter range. The Brentel Star is launching its first squadron. It's time for us to do the same. I assume you'll be leading the boarding party to go after the general. Whatever's necessary to finish this. There's one other thing. I promised you my help, so I brought you some supplies from the cargo bay. Someone on Drummond Cast may be disappointed when they don't receive the delivery, but I thought our situation took precedence. You're doing well, Captain. Continue when we may make it out of this. Thank you. We're all doing our best here. I advise that you proceed to the shuttle bay. The flight to the Brentol Star may be hazardous, but Grand Moff Kilran has complete faith in your abilities. Or, uh, before they updated it, there would have been a crate here you could open. Let's get down to the hangar bay. Here to browse our inventory. Prepare our stuff. Sell this junk. Thank you for your patronage. Let's get moving. This is a, uh, a staged uh, bonus objective. So see stage one, defeat Republic forces, three of 25. 
once we do that, it'll move on to another stage of the side quest. So I think there's three, maybe four stages. This is Protocol Unit NRO2. I hope you're receiving this message clearly, and that your flight was free of incident. Please hold for Security Coordinator Ensign Brukhara. The Marines are on their way. They'll follow you in and hold each junction you secure. Try not to take too long. We're not a military ship. What you have is all you're getting. Thanks for the heads up. I have been scanning the Brental Star's communications, and security forces appear to be moving to protect the escape pods. It is extremely likely that the crew is attempting to evacuate the General. You must retrieve or eliminate him before he escapes. We'll have the General before the crew knows what's happening. Excellent news. I will be in contact if the situation changes. Proceed to assault all defense points between you and the target. Done him with the fusion. Alright, hit this guy with the tracer. Fusion. Last. 
Security forces, prepare the fire. Rail shot. You're speaking to a special forces commander, Meat. Show some respect. Commander Gil. Gahil. Galil. Gullo. How the hell do you say your name, dude? Alright, we'll hit you with the tracer. So, hit you think you're fusion. tough, Meat? Ah! Part of me was hoping you'd try to board this ship. Oh, well, here I am, dude. Not just the pretty sidekick, Buster. Get out of this fire. a little bit, but endurance power and critical rating are way up. Get him with the fusion.
Look at this guy. XR7 command droid. Hit him with the tracer. Fusion. shot. Battleship. That would 
give you rewards for your personal character, and you could also do quests that would give your would be gear for your companion, so they wouldn't just look like this the entire game. Oh well. I miss those. Escape pods aren't far now. You can make it on your own, General. And what about you? I will face my destiny. Go now, my friend. Halt where you are. I am Yadira Ban, Padawan of the Jedi Order. I was sent to protect the General, and you will not pass. Surrender. Give me what I want, and your ship can survive. I cannot accept that. A Jedi does not surrender the innocent into the hands of evil. But I intend to drive you back, meter by meter if need be. Just as the Republic pushed the Sith Empire into the dark of the galaxy. Makes no difference to me. You're keeping me from my target. I hope one day you'll see beyond your selfish desires. But I cannot be the one to teach you. Mm hmm Oh well. To die. You may run, or you may stand your ground, but you'll go no farther. You aren't going to win this. Aww. I swear it. Get away! Blast him with the dark. You aren't going to win this. I swear it. I'm sure you swear it. Hit him with a fuse pistol. And a tracer. You aren't going to win this. I swear it. Come on, man, that droid is tough for you. You aren't going to win this. I swear it. Gotcha. I thought you swore it. General. You can put aside your weapons. I won't try to run. Besides, I doubt I'd make it to an escape pod without my intestines spilling out. Gross. I take it you're the General. Grand Moff Kilrin sent me to find you. Kilrin did? Of course. He would have the gall to send a transport to take on a warship and succeed. I was a general in the Imperial Military Service. Did they tell you that when they sent you here? Did they even know? Believe whatever you want. It doesn't change your fate. If you knew what I knew, you'd understand. If you'd heard what both sides are plotting, you wouldn't be eager to restart this war. 
They're building doomsday weapons, shields that envelop planets, missiles that darken suns. Republic and Empire are planning to raise worlds, annihilate civilizations. It will be unlike anything the galaxy's seen since the great hyperspace war. And it's too late to stop it. The so-called peace is already lost. I've heard enough of this. Yes. I shouldn't expect you'd care. Nope. Just hired for a Will job. you have dude. me then? Me, my stomach full of blood, and my implant full of cybernetic secrets and stolen plans. <laughs> what will you do? I'm gonna bring you to my ship. From there you'll be transported to Drummond Kaas and taken into Imperial custody. Where I'll be tortured or executed, or at best, placed in a cell for the rest of my life. Still, there's nowhere in the galaxy where I could truly hide. I will follow you. Alright, time to skedaddle. Captain Orzik here. I understand you're on your way back. I assume congratulations are in order. Our Marines have been recalled to the Black Talon. As soon as you're aboard, we'll jump to light speed. Republic reinforcements could arrive at any minute. Very well, I understand. I'll see you on the bridge. Congratulations again. Orzik out. Alright, let's get the hell off of this shit. Get to the transport. Any coming? Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Gotcha, General. All right, Captain Orzik. Well, the heroes of the day return. Welcome back, sir. My men will take the General to the brig. Congratulations. I never expected the mission to go off this cleanly. There were some rough spots, but nothing I couldn't handle. I've no doubt. You've shown impressive judgment. Grand Moff Kilrin is eagerly awaiting your report. Should I put him through? It's your command again. Make the call. Put the Grand Moff through. Opening channel now. Well... How fortunate I could reach my friends aboard the Black Talon. The droid's been keeping me appraised of your work, but I've very much wanted to hear from you. How did the attack go? The Brentel Star has been disabled and the General captured. He'll be in your hands soon. Excellent. I'll let Korriban and Imperial Intelligence fight over him. You should be proud. This is only one of the many operations we're conducting across the galaxy. It's a new beginning to the war. The General was one of the greatest weapons the Republic had. A defector. And you've snatched him from enemy hands. I'll remember this. And I'll make sure you're rewarded. Remember my name. Spread it around. I'll make sure your heroism is mentioned when I report to the other Moffs. But my words hardly matter. Soon you'll be joining us on the home world, And you can see for yourself what you've been fighting for. It should be inspiring. Enjoy the rest of your journey. Kilrun out. 
It's not my home world, dude. Oh yeah, got titles. Hire gun. Off to Droman Kass. <sighs> Power transport. Use those in your house. What the hell? What kind of outfit is that, dude? It's like a Republic trooper mixed with a Jedi. Parts all smell the same. Engine exhaust, coolant fluid, and spacers who haven't bathed in a week. Let's get out of this stink. Whatever the rest of Drummond Cost is like, the air has got to be fresher than in here. I would have figured you'd been to Drummond Cost before. Braden and I moved around a lot when we first got together, but we never made it here. Just a reminder this is an imperial world, which means rules, rules, and more rules. If we tweak the local authorities, they can make life really hard. My goal is to join the Great Hunt. That's it. Still, let's try to keep a low profile. Come on, the Mandalorian Enclave is in the Citadel. Our contact is someone named Chris DeMarcon. Go ahead and get rid of the exploration missions. Ah, looks like we got a good price on, uh, Devram's cousin gave him a good price on a speeder, so now we got that. <laughs> Long spur staff. these heroic missions. And then... Ready for departure. Let's get to Cost City. Enjoy your stay. Alright, 
Please use all products only as intended. Sell this junk. Be well. Ready for departure. Enjoy your stay. Wanna be evil, Coruscant. I'm here to claim the bounty on this Republic scientist. Name's Albea. Albia, you say? One moment. Yes, here. Wanted dead. You certainly fulfilled that part. Give me a moment to verify her identity. Very good. Here's your dispensation. Now, if you don't mind, I need to call for someone to clean this up. Hell yeah, 990 credits. Cleanse is a friendly target of up to two negative tech or physical effects. Put you over here. Omi topi. Omi topi. And then I told him, You think that's cold? You should see what I did to the Gamorian. I never saw a Rodian run so fast in my... Whoa. Hello, handsome. You here to sweep me off my feet? We are here for the Great Hunt. We've been sponsored by Nemro the Hut. Oh, what's this? Got yourself a pet? Little sister, maybe? It's not enough to hold a real man's interest, anyway. Mako's my backup. That's all you need to know. Didn't mean anything. It's just rare we get any fresh meat in here worth putting on the grill. Can you change the subject already? Oh, don't get your blaster jammed. You probably ain't gonna like what I'm about to tell you. But there's nothing I can do about it, understand? There's one spot left open in the Great Hunt, and over three dozen hunters who got sponsorships. You don't expect me to just give up, do you? Of course not. But life's about to get a bit crazy. You best be ready. The Huntmaster himself will explain how we're gonna sort things out. Head into the main room, and show some respect. When the Huntmaster's done talking, come on back in here. I'll be handling you from here on out. Alright, talk to the Huntmaster. Quiet! Quiet, you dogs! The Huntmaster is about to speak. Pay attention and show some respect for once in your lives. <coughs> you heard the Huntmaster. You're competing for the last spot in the Great Hunt by taking down three bounties on Droman Kos. You expect us to hunt here with Imperials crawling all over us and Sith? Let the man talk. I want to hear this. For all you overblown, useless, no-talent cowards, we installed a handy exit door. Use it now! The rest of you, the real hunters, go see your handlers. They'll get you oriented to the planet and assign you three unique bounties. 
Everyone who takes down all three of their bounties wins a spot in the final melee. Anyone who doesn't get all three is out. Hunting on Drummond Koss? That's suicide. I'm grabbing the first shuttle out of here. I suggest you do the same, friend. You'll be one less body for me to step over. At least you got the attitude right. Don't expect this world to roll over for you, though. I'm done here. May your quarry fall before you, Hunter. Well, what are you standing around for? Back to your handler. That's Krista for you, new blood. All right. Bunch of cowards. Makes it easier for me. A dozen cowards just scurried out of here. Probably won't stop till Droman Kaus is light years behind him. You understand the basics, right? Three bounties, hardest targets on Droman Kaus. Gotta get all three to qualify for the final melee. Enough standing around. Who are my bounties? Now let's see who your first target is. Whoa, this can't be right. You got enemies among the Mandalorians or something? Just Taro Blood, the Mandalorian who killed Raiden. What'd he do? I'm used to having the cards stacked against me. I wouldn't wish this bounty on anybody. Gotta play the hand you're dealt, though. The target's a Republic noble named Valtaka. He got captured during an Imperial raid, brought back here, and sold into slavery by mistake. Why was selling him into slavery a mistake? He should have been ransomed. But Altaka wasn't properly identified when he got captured. Altaka's slave group was building a big old statue in the jungle. The slaves rebelled and took over the site. Nobody can get in there. We don't even know if he's still alive. If he is, the family will pay big. I've been looking to earn some real credits for a change. Well, now's your chance. Assuming you can never find the guy. The slaves got themselves a tent camp near that statue they never finished. If Altaka's still kicking, he's probably somewhere in there. Before you go, meet your new best friend. The S-86K full-gauge carbonite armor upgrade. You can't shoot a fella with this while he's <laughs> springing around. It's too slow to charge up. But once that fella ain't resisting, say, after a good long beating, the S-86K will freeze him for transport. Hmm. Didn't know they made devices to freeze people. Carbonite ain't so much freezing as it is... Well, I ain't got a clue, really. <laughs> Just have fun. You find that Republic noble fella and claim that first bounty, then hurry it on back here as fast as you can. All right. Alrighty guys, now we are gonna call it there for today. When we come back, we will take care of all these bounties on Drum and Cost. We probably finish this planet in one go, one episode, who knows. But until then, I will see y'all next time.